Hello, my name's Jupiter Hadley, and everyone kept asking me if I was covering the 7-day FPS jam, so I am. I'm playing as many of the games as I can for a minute each, 10 per video. Links to the individual games will be in the description so you can check them out further. This is a game development challenge to make first-person games in 7 days. So, yeah, we're going to get right into it. If you want to support this sort of content, please support me on Patreon so I can make more time to record game jam games. And, uh, let's begin. We're playing Frug87. Colonel, Colonel, John D. Wyzoon elected to your office only three years ago. The year is 1964, and a CIA with a lust for Soviet blood is hungry for any news of a chance to pick more men off of the Soviet fleet. A message comes in the mail announcing for a cover operation, covert, covert operation in which you are to take back the cinema, and ultimately unimportant military base on the Volga River. As the main devotion, as a man devoted to your country and the paycheck you receive monthly, after a mission in Bar Bahrain, you are stuck at a French outpost with minimal supplies. On order from the CIA, you are to be given every am ammunition in the outpost, all of eighty-seven bullets. Get in, take control, get out. That's not a lot of bullets. Oh, and I've already used one. Beautiful. Let me find you. Alright, well, something's shooting me, so... Oh, that, that's the bad guy. Okay. I didn't realize that those were the bad guys. What a strange outpost. It's almost like a maze. I wish there was more animation on the bad guys so I knew like when they were attacking me and whatnot. Because they seem to have like better aim and I feel like if I saw bullets I'd be able to I don't know. Maybe die less. I died. Okay, well, next. We're playing Boot Camp Simulations. Welcome to Raytech Boot Camp Simulations version 1.0. We thank you for donating your consciousness for evaluation to Dogu, our state of the art co cooperative, corporate, cooperative, cooperative intelligence. Sorry, we're reading. Not great today. So tired. Together, you and Dogu will perform, play, and achieve various objects objectives in 12 virtual simulations. If you proceed, you are agreeing to 1. Waive privacy protections afforded by your citizen license. 2. Dogu has been trained on database containing databases data sets containing cultural media from the protected archive provisions for release for restricted simulations under the 24th amendment to the human re I don't care. That's fine. Sure. Let's do it. I spy. Point and click at all red balloons. I like red balloons. Wait. Boop. 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 Oh, I need to move around. Boop. Boop. Cool, I got $250. Describe what you did in the previous simulation. Point at red things that made a beep noise. I think I did. Uh, not much. Just looked around point at red circles. Yeah. Where did you work previously? You got my resume right. I did some odd jobs here and there. Whenever I could find something to survive for next month. A stable contract working at some rich senator's estate. They found something wrong about me and fired me without service. Been unemployed for a while. Let's do the rich person. Simulation 2. Ignition. Click all the red objects. Okay. Awesome. We got way more that time. Describe the target from the previous simulation. It was a circular red thing, I just hit it disappeared. Red balloon, I think. It's a red spear, not sure why I was targeting them, but I guess they're just, yeah, that one. Do you have any criminal records? Nope, I'm clean, go check if you want. Interesting. I do like how creepy this all feels because I have to answer questions. Next. I'm ready dying. We're playing Scorpion Squadron. It's like Scorpio, I don't know, I don't know. It started really fast and now I'm dead. It also locks your mouse in, and there's no way to get it to like lower the sound or do anything that you want to do. Beware. I'm gonna take this. Oh, 
Oh crap. Need to reload. Oh, if you just run. They're like invisible. Or I can see the legs behind me. Yeah, I don't really know what's going on or how to do anything. I can't seem to kill him. Hit that one a lot. That's it, yeah, I'm out of ammo. Well, I have ammo. How do I there we go, reload? I killed one. Yeah, we killed another. Okay, cool. We did it. Death. Hey, there's a plane. Oh, it's our plane. It's clearly broken. Cool, cool, cool. Take some bullets. This guy's having some fun. Moving around this. Please die. Awesome. Huh. Next. We're playing Steel City. My computer's not going to like this. Okay. Okay. Did we collect it? Did we collect like, the orb? Oh, they come to us. We're magnetic. Okay, that's fun. I am getting, like, motion sickness. Like, I feel nauseous playing this. But I'm having a good time. The graphics are really beautiful. Ooh, we got a big one. Oh, there's a there's a timer. And it doesn't increase when I grab stuff, so I guess I just gotta get everything I can in this time limit. Which, I mean, I'm probably not gonna do very well because I took a while just smashing into walls. Like this. I scored 23. Okay. Simple game. I like the graphics. Next. We're playing slide, penguin slide. I already had started sliding, so. So I hit like a snow dip and was kind of restarting. It's kind of cool that we can slide uphill. I feel like in real life that wouldn't work. We'd be constantly sliding downhill, but who knows? I feel like we're underwater now. Imagine just being a little penguin in the winter time. Just sliding around a big old biome. Doesn't seem to be anything to like collect or discover yet, so it's just a little penguin sliding around. Whoop, underwater. I feel like underwater should give us negative points. Penguins don't want to slide underwater. It's not a simple game, but everything works. Hopefully they expand on it. Next. We're playing through Blood and Flesh. We're gonna play middle instead of cozy and hard because that seems like average, maybe? I mean, this is in browser, but my computer is really, really struggling with it. Which is a bit of a shame. Yeah, I don't think that we can play this. I quite like the graphic style. I guess these big red blobs are what we're aiming for. Again. Maybe this one as well. Well, there's quite a reload when it comes to actual like time it takes to shoot. Oh, we got it. Also, we're pretty bad at this game. <laughs> right, we're playing Green Makeout Institution. I have no idea how to play this. We seem to be a floating pair of hands that can kind of grip stuff. Uh, day one, game jam time. Make your ultimate game. Green makeout. 
in subjection, press the game dev button lock. Oh. I pressed it, screen. No, don't turn off. There you go. Is that how to make a game? I didn't know it was this easy to make games. Your doctor needs you to reach the obelisk. Alright. I'm not really sure how to shoot or anything. And I'm just following these people. Sail. So, never eaten an olive. I've eaten olives. Those people are dead. Uh, people died in 1722. Playing do cubes levitate? We'll find out. No, it's space to jump. Right, we lift the cube. If you or the cube falls, reach the door. Oh wow. This looks good. Our jump is floaty. Maybe I just don't play it. Ugh. Maybe I just don't play enough first person games. Maybe the jump is always floaty. Oh no. I think both of us fell. Okay. Bit of a challenge this. Cubes move a lot. Don't know if I'm actually the right person for this game. Pretty sure that's how it should look though, so. My gun's actually stuck on that, not me as a human. Awesome, got into the door, doesn't matter. Where's the door? Ah. Which one of you is the tallest? That one? Yes, yeah, this one. There you go. There's gonna be a lot of moving stuff around just for me to fall off right towards the end. Oh, you're actually taller. Ah. Move this. Here. Move you. There. I mean, that looks pretty good. What are you next? Right here. Right here. Time to play parkour. Nope. Move this. Move you. Closer. That looks like good enough placement. Nope. Darn it. Next. We're playing Stray. I have a body in this one. Clearly out in the mountains. Seems to have been some sort of wreck. And also a mysterious orb. How do I pick you up? Orb. Got it. What do I do with it? I like that I'm holding it with my mind. Here, go over there, orb. Maybe it goes on that, actually. Huh. Hmm. Are there more orbs? I mean, probably, by the looks of things. If they're what powers everything. Hmm, I can't really go up there, though. 
Invisible wall. Weird. Interesting world. Next. We're playing crossbow. Oh, we can hit them even if like we don't directly hit them. As long as they run into our arrow. We have one left. Oh, I don't think we won. They take a lot of hits. But then if they're piled up, they take less. Oh, we moved on. Darn it, we missed. I guess there's like some allocations for missing though. Especially if you get like two at a time. But getting multiples at a time seems to be the only way you can actually win. Oh, maybe not. Yeah. Whoa. It's got hard. Next.